Hey guys, William Murphy here, and in this evening's episode, I just wanted to clear up a few things. So this morning, I posted a video up at 4.15am, and uh, unfortunately, when I woke up this morning ready to go to work, I received a voicemail from a very disgruntled fellow YouTuber. So I wanted to clear the air a little bit and try and smooth things over to make sure that my videos are technically correct, I'm using the correct terminology, and I don't want to, and I quote, disappoint and uh, an embarrassment to the YouTube community. So, my video on the distributor cap and the distributor and the misfire. So basically, I made a few comments with regards to the cap about which bits were what. <laughs> so in my video I made reference to the contact points inside being classed as points. That is incorrect, they are electrodes. And um, the centre section in the middle um, isn't the centre section in the middle, it is a central carbon pickup. Uh, but the thing that I got most wrong, and I've had to make a note of this to make sure that I get the point across correctly now, is I said that the ignition coil provides a permanent life to the distributor. That is incorrect. Now the ignition coil does not supply a permanent life to the cap. It has a pulsed life um, in time with the ignition timing, uh, points or electronic ignition. So in my case I've got electronic ignition so it's done electronically. In the case of the standard or the old style points and condenser, every time you get your contact point, that is then sending an electronic pulse. Um, so I just feel like I wanted to get this point across. I have been a letdown to the YouTube community, myself, my friends, and my family, and I do apologize. Um, so I've cleared that up, and I'm sorry. Right, all jokes aside, I just wanted to make sure I got these points across. Um, myself and the other YouTubers, we're not professionals. Uh, we just do this for fun, really. Trying to get the content across to you guys in a correct manner is, is quite important. So I just wanted to make sure I used the right terminology and made the amendment to the error of my ways. Um, and rightly so, it's picked up. I'm. I'm not an embarrassment to the YouTube community, but I do want to make sure that I get the information to you guys correctly, um, because anything that we say um, sometimes is taken in gospel for some things. I mean, Facebook is a great example. If someone asks a question there, some of the responses are um, rather comical. And uh, yeah, so it's best just to try and get my errors out of the way with, and uh, onwards and upwards. So, just a quick one. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already seen the previous video, click over here and uh, please consider subscribing to the channel so you don't miss out any future content. That is it from me and I'll see you next time. Take it easy.